My name is Lunga MK and this is Arts Adaptation brought to you by Maredi Holdings, sponsored by the Department of Sports, Arts and Culture to raise awareness on the COVID-19 pandemic. Guys, we are streaming live, bringing you music, jazz, poetry, soul. So stay there, stay in your seats, wear your masks, use your sanitizers and enjoy the music virtually. I'm 
that you might not see your amazing heart and your rich spirit someone else you might not know or even see loves you as is sees you for you who you are you might not appreciate or even realize the fullness you are right now but someday one day you will you will be grateful for those who saw still see you for the magnitude you are you are worth the try worth the effort, worth the push, worth the drive. You're worth it. So was I me. My name is Lunga MK, I'm a self-proclaimed poet. I am a poet by art and a healer by life and choice. I'm going to share a piece entitled Worn. It's a piece that celebrates individualism and Africanism. And I just hope that you guys love it and celebrate your own. Worn. What is it that I wear as my own? What is it that defines and signifies the true essence of who I am? What is it that makes me tick and provokes my thoughts so I can actually think? What is it that I alone can prophesy as my own? What is it that determines the me I am, I say I am before God and myself? Is it my beaded crown that accentuates my being like a brown-skinned girl with four locks that flow within the depths of my roots, unlocking the passages of my truth? Or is it in my exaggerated language and speech? And I confuse my former oppressor that still lingers the pressure over my head because I express myself better in a language not known to be my own. And I seem to believe I know better just because I speak the language of my oppressor with such ease? Is it in the clothes we wear that produce a wave of color and exudes beauty, celebrating our diversity? Gisho, from our head wraps to our torn jeans. Amahi and Isamba to Sabo Mama Bumtanda as our all. Are we hung on the current discombobulating trends that put forward nudity and push back Ubusebendalu? Ismilo Nesota. Maybe it is in the way we celebrate and embrace unism. A beautiful cusp of elated kicks, ululations and praise songs celebrating fairly like gods. Be it tears open grounds over hurt and disdain or the beauty that is the coming together of two families. Sagita, Sakenza, Uzego Shonilanga. Maybe the magic of who I am, who we are, is embedded deeply in the discerning of not conforming where the lies are gushing of authenticity and originality that continuously and constantly flows like the rivers where our forefathers' spirits still remain calm within the waters. Maybe how we sing and dance expounds the burning feeling from inside that pop our veins. We hear the drums so viciously take away any conceit, a rising and roaring of spirit that so demandingly starts to sing. It then speaks 
and applause of clap and tap highlights all these different characters. And in that moment, you're reminded why twerking could never be an African concept. Because on this end, spirituality and music and dance is spirituality. It's not trapped in sexuality. Maybe that what signifies who we are is being known not to be facile as we stand out so brightly and boldly like the rising of the moon. No scaffolds on the uniqueness of the imprints we choose to live with our footprints because on their own they will speak to the choices we seek. Maybe what we wear is our own is definitely written in our skins, painted in our hearts, sung in our spirits, meditated upon in our souls. That what I wear as my own is my truth, undiluted, where incense draws me back to my ancestors and church bells knock into my soul, where beauty just is and is not drawn onto my face. That's what I wear as my own is the me I am, I say I am before God and myself. I am a whimsical of life, an African by choice, black by love without a doubt. Brown skinned without a flinch. I am what I wear as my own. Thank you. It's your time to shine.
Thank you. Le hofi mahaye, le hofi. Le hofi, you know. Oh, 